So for this video, our question asks, it says, if the vertex of the parabola, y is equal to 4x squared minus 5x plus 10, is the point hk, what is the value of k? So they gave us the equation for a parabola. All right. And uh, the vertex of a parabola is known to be hk. And that comes from the formula uh, and standard form of a parabola looks like this. So y is equal to a times x minus h squared plus k, where the values here, hk, represent the vertex of the parabola. And as we know, when it comes to parabolas and graphing them, everything kind of stems from the vertex on out. So it's a very important uh, point to know when it comes to parabolas. Now, it's definitely easier to determine the vertex of a parabola when it's in standard form like this. And if we can see the equation that we were given, y is equal to 4x squared minus 5x plus 10, this is not in standard form. So we can't just simply pick out hk from the formula, or specifically they want to know the value of k. Now, we could put it in standard form, but there's actually a different way that we can do this here. So the point hk right, represents the vertex of a parabola, where h is the x value for that vertex, and k is the y value for that vertex. There's a little mini formula that we have that looks like this. x is equal to negative b over 2a, where if we plug into this formula, we will get the x value for our vertex. So essentially, this is going to give us h. And as long as we know what h is, we can then find k. Now, this formula here, it says x is equal to negative b over 2a. So we got to remember that this just comes from uh, the quadratic uh, form of an equation, so ax squared plus bx plus c, where a is the coefficient of the x squared term, b is the coefficient of the x to the first power term, and c is not in the formula, but c represents your constant. All right, so we can pull the values a and b directly from our equation that we're given, plug it into this, find x, and then we'll be able to figure out uh, what y is, which is your k. All right, so uh, our formula is negative b over 2a, right? So negative b, our b is going to be this negative 5 there, right? It's the coefficient of your x to the first power over 2a, and a for our equation here is a 4. All right, so double negative rule in the numerator here, minus that negative cancels out, leaving us with 5 over 2 times 4 is equal to 8. All right, so this is h of our formula. All right, out of hk, we know h, so 5 eighths. We need to figure out what k is. Well, remember that 5 eighths is just an x value in our equation, and if we plug in that x value into our equation, we should be able to figure out what y is. All right, so... Let's go ahead and plug in 5 eighths into x. That way we can figure out what our y value is, which is just our k for our vertex. So that would be 4 times x squared. And remember, our x is 5 eighths. So squared minus 5 times x. So that's 5 times 5 eighths plus 10. Simplifying this, let's see. Working with our exponent here, we have 5 eighths squared. So that's 5 eighths times 5 eighths which is 25 over 64. Um, let, let, let me just go ahead and drop everything else down. All right, our next step is to go ahead and do the multiplication here. So 4 times 25 is 100 over 64, minus 5 times 5 is 25 over 8, plus 10. And whenever we add and subtract all of this together, I'm just going to go ahead and let you know what it is. If you want to do the work for it, for adding and subtracting these fractions, you can. But when we add and subtract these together, we get 135 over 16 represents our y value for that point. But because we're talking about the vertex here, this is really just the hk. It's the same thing as an x and a y. It's just the x and the y value for the vertex of your parabola. 
So uh, 5 ace and 135 over 16 represents the vertex of this parabola. Uh, they specifically just wanted us to give them what K is equal to. So K is your Y coordinate. So that is 135 over 16 for K. Okay, so just simply plug it into our little mini equation over here. Plug that into your equation to find Y and there you go. Otherwise, that's it for this video.